Voters in Olmstead County will see candidates for Olmstead County Attorney on the ballot two weeks from today. And tonight was one last chance for those candidates to face off in a debate. ABC6 News reporter Mackenzie Davis is live at 125 Live where that meeting was held tonight and has more from the candidates. Mackenzie. Well, James and Laura, tonight we heard from incumbent Mark Ostrom and challenger Karen McLaughlin. And this debate tonight was a little contentious, but it was one last time the candidates could hear from, or the public rather, could hear from candidates before voting in November. I will say I'm offended that Ms. McLaughlin has been walking around our neighborhoods telling my community members that they should vote for her because I'm going to retire. That's offensive. A friend of mine came up to me a couple weeks ago and told me that somebody knocked on her door, it was Karen, and, and told that my friend that they should vote for her because I was going to retire. I feel strongly that it's time for a change in the county attorney's office, that Mr. Ostrom sat in this room four years ago and said that was his last run, and here we are running again. And as to this comment that I said four years ago, I wasn't going to run again, I've never said that. I've never even told my wife that. Mark Ostrom has held the position of Olmsted County Attorney for 16 years. He says his main priority as county attorney is addressing gun violence in the community. Ostrom says he's committed to finishing out his career as Olmsted County Attorney. I don't think that he answered the question about whether he was going to fulfill his term. That's very concerning to me. McLaughlin, a trial attorney of 19 years and a current Rochester Public School Board member, says her priorities, if elected, are to support safe communities for everyone, especially the BIPOC and immigrant communities. She says she would also proactively reduce gun violence, not just address it after it happens, particularly in the context of domestic violence. I think it's very important to focus on fairness and building trust with the community. And I think that those things are very lacking with Mr. Ostrom's office. And McLaughlin added that she thinks her experience as both an attorney and a school board member makes her more fit for the job. Whereas Ostrom, who has, like I said, been doing this for 16 years throughout the night, kept saying he has been there and done that and he hopes to continue to serve the county. James and Laura.